fairy tales, a hero might marry a princess to bring two warring tribes together. In the southern Mexican state of Oaxaca, this man is the mayor of San Pedro Huamelula, who married a crocodile, which the locals call the little princess. This celebration dates back to 1789. According to tradition, this marriage brings luck to local fishermen and farmers in the coastal area of Chontel in the Isthmus of Tehuantepec. The mayor of San Pedro Huamelula, Victor Aguilar, represents a Chontal prince, and the crocodile represents a Huave princess from the community of San Mateo del Mar. According to the reenactment, the two communities found peace in this wedding after years of conflict. La boda del ciudadano presidente municipal con la princesa, que es la lagarta, que así se le denomina, eh, pues meramente esto eh, ya es un, meramente un festejo de alegría que representa la unidad, la convivencia de los chontales, pero en, en otros tiempos, según la, la, la historia, según la leyenda, según las costumbres, pues bueno, esto... Esto se da en la pugna que existía en un tiempo entre los chontales y los guaves. In the early morning, surrounded by music, a group of people walks with the crocodile from house to house, where it is greeted with joy. Later, the reptile is dressed up in a wedding dress for the ceremony. This year, the crocodile was named Emma Narváez after the real wife of the mayor. The ritual is led by an indigenous leader who asks the mayor if he accepts the princess as his bride. After saying yes, the couple dances to the beat of traditional music. Legend says the Wave people could transform into any animal. At the time, the princess transformed into a crocodile, who then journeyed to San Pedro Huamelula by sea. This ancestral tradition continues to be preserved over the years, with the Chontal people saying it brings peace, a good harvest and abundant seafood.